this video, we will test the internal disk speed of the 14-inch MacBook Pro with an M4 Max chip and 36 gigabytes of unified memory and a one terabyte internal SSD. We will use two different methods. First, using the popular Blackmagic disk speed test and then using amorphous disk mark. But before we begin, Feast your eyes on the precise and elegant design of the new MacBook Pro M4. Observe the intricate craftsmanship that underlies its sleek form. Note the precision-cut aluminium surfaces, polished to a mesmerizing sheen. Each component testifies to a profound understanding of the marriage between function and form. Here we see a small mammal of the feline species, commonly referred to as domestic cat, an exemplar of remarkable agility and stealth, perfectly adapted to its surroundings. And there it is again. Now, we will evaluate the data read and writing speeds of the internal MacBook Pro M4 SSD using Black Magic Disk Speed Test. First, we will perform the test using a setting of 5 GB file size. The internal disk starts its run at a respectable 5,200 MB per second write and 5,080 read speeds. But it was just warming up. Observe as write speeds accelerate to over 6,300. Read speeds, on the other hand, remain fairly stable, between 5,080 and 5,180. Write speeds finally reached over 6,400. Now, let's observe the speed as the internal disk sets its sights on one gigabyte file sizes. With lightning-fast reflexes, it lunges at the target with precision, unleashing its full energy, revealing its true predatory capabilities. At up to 7,750 write speeds, the data is devoured in a swift and ruthless display of power. It's over. Read speeds, however, remain more modest at around 5,050. Let's now observe the results with another speed test software. Amorphous disk mark, which calculates speeds differently. To compare with the previous results, let's run the test with the same one gigabyte file size settings. At these settings, the software does five iterations of reading and writing giving the average results. The display of the results is inverted, with read speeds on the left and write speeds on the right. To remain comparable, we'll only consider the top line of results. Here, we see much higher read speeds at 6,550 than we did with Black Magic Disk Speed Test. But the write speeds are more similar averaging a remarkable 7,300 megabytes per second. Black Magic Disk Speed Test is designed to measure disk speed in a video editing context. But Amorphous Disk Mark measures more general data transfer speeds. So the numbers you see here should be more representative of speeds to expect for more general usage in the wild. With every leap in speed and power, technology becomes a reflection of human ambition. Let us use these advancements not just to do more, but to do better for ourselves and for the world around us.